Hello all, this is Priya. So today I'm going to talk about what is OET. As I told you yesterday, OET is an English exam which consists of four modules, listening, reading, writing and speaking. So it, when you take off the listening, what is what what you're going to do in listening is you'll be hearing to a conversation between a doctor and a patient or some health professional and a patient so you'll be given questions regarding that and with that you have to pick up the right, correct answer what you listened and you have to fill up the answer so that's how listening will be so reading in reading module you have to read something and understand it and answer the questions and in case of writing, you have to write a letter or like a referral letter or transfer letter to the care where the patient is going to be in the future. Like whether the patient is going to be discharged from the hospital and they're going to the care home, you have to write a uh, transfer letter according to that. So you'll be given a task and the details of the patient. So with that, using that, you have to write the letter to the authority. Okay, so in case of speaking, you will be given a role play. Role play is nothing but you will be given about a patient and if you are a nurse, so you will be given a task to do in your side. So it will, it will differ for, for each professional. If the patient, if the, if the candidate is a doctor, so they will be given a role play according to their profession. If the patient, if the um, candidate is a pharmacist, so it will be given according to that. So it will little it will slightly differ from each uh, profession so if you are a nurse you will be given a task according to that so you have to convince the patient or you have to uh, inform the patient regarding the task and make him convinced and uh, you have to make the patient accept it and go for the treatment because uh, for example if the patient is a uh, patient need a blood transfusion and in that case the patient is not willing to do it you'll be given a task and you'll be uh, you'll be explaining what is it and you'll be uh, convincing the patient by using the task and uh, the knowledge what we have so that is about speaking so this is the outline of the listening reading writing and speaking to make you feel much more understandable so i've i've uh, given the sample questionnaire for listening reading writing and speaking uh, in the description so you can just go and check so uh, while hearing it looks like it is slightly easier of course it is easier but the only thing is you need more practice of course practice makes a man perfect so you can start practicing there is lots and lots of materials in youtube you could see if you just go and type oet listening or oet reading in youtube you will get lots and lots of materials so please do start practicing today and uh, as i told you before i'm going to give you the link in my description about the sample questions so you can just go and see that the thing is so many friends suggested me that to put in english because I have a lot of friends in uh, friends from all over India. After coming here, I've met so many p people, and uh, what they suggesting me is so many doesn't know about what is it. If I am talking in my mother tongue, like which is Tamil, they may not understand. So that is the only reason um, I've just changed it. But that's why I'm not full English. I don't expect to be able to do it. I'm not going to be able to do it. I'm not going to be able to do it. I'm not going to be able to do it. Most probably it will be in Tangle. So, so I'll see you in video. I'll see you tomorrow in the next video. Taibusenji, go and check the link in my description it will be very useful for you and you can just see what is there and the questions how it will be so first starting la maybe you ungalku konja puriyama irukalam but ninga oru oru idha ninga panni start panni practice panna aarambikumbodhu you will easily get it so all the very best yara irundhalum if you are willing to go, come to uk just start your preparation so all the best See you tomorrow in my next video. Bye.